Are you ready? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Why did we do this to ourselves? <laughs> Might have to take the knee. Oh, don't it really hurt? Let me air lift it out. <laughs> We're about to take on one of the most difficult hikes that you can do in Bali. And at the bottom is one of the deadliest beaches. We'll get into why that is in a little while. The reason that we're doing this right now is because they're about to take it away. More on that on the way down because we've got a hike to do. We are starting our descent down. It's, it starts with some pretty big steps. Like if you think about normal steps, these steps are like three times the size. So we are currently going down the steps, which is probably the easiest part of the trek and then it gets really, really difficult. I'm already tired. <laughs> <laughs> the way down. <laughs> no, there's still a long way to go and soon the steps will stop. Yes. And then there's a little bit of rock climbing. And just free falling probably <laughs> because I'm definitely going to fall over. Hopefully not. <laughs> and the steps have stopped. Time to start rock climbing. <laughs> so if you haven't already guessed, we're at Kalinking Beach, otherwise known as T-Rex Beach because apparently it looks like a little T-Rex. <laughs> People come from all around the world to take pictures here, mainly right at the top of the cliff, but the beauty is in the challenge going down. It's about 45 minutes to one hour to make the trek down, and it's pretty treacherous. We're still so close to the beginning. I know. <laughs> okay, this is the point of no return. This is when it gets really intense. Are you ready? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. And these guys do it with coconuts on their back. Crazy. But that means we get to enjoy coconut on the bottom. <laughs> you do this every day? Yeah. Oh. I'm already excited for the coconut. <laughs> also, it's getting hotter, which means my hair has to go up because I'm getting warm. <laughs> okay, you got this. We got this. Woo -woo. Woo -woo. I feel like it really is in the mindset. Like you've got to be ready to do this. It's worth it alone just for the views down. Like, look how amazing it is already. My legs are so little. How am I supposed to do this? <laughs> Come on, little legs. Look at this. That's basically just a drop with like half a step. Ooh. Come on. Down here. Oh, my legs are shaking. <laughs> I still don't think that's the most difficult part either. That was like the beginning of the difficult part. <laughs> <laughs> coming back up is gonna be... Hell. Oh. Just hell. That's <laughs> the only word to describe coming back up. So let's watch just, out for that bit. <laughs> <laughs> let's just focus on this for now. The reason we're doing it. It's so beautiful. <laughs> See? You can see down here all the path, so it goes all down here and zigzags down. It's basically a sheer drop, which is crazy. You can see part of the path over here, and Matt's making his way down. But look at this. You okay? Oh. Like little steps that you can like step on 
on the way down, but it's still tough. We've got our first casualty. It really hurts. Might have oh. to take the knee. Oh, don't. It really hurts. This is great. Uh, <laughs> oh. Do we need to get you airlifted out? Get me airlifted out. <laughs> We're down to the abseiling part. <laughs> oh, I've not got any strength. Not... How are you actually supposed to do this? You good? You made it look very easy. Oh. We're pretty close now. Yeah, we're not too far now. I've got a little grazed knee, which really hurts, but we're gonna move on from that. To wash it in the ocean. Wash it in the ocean. But we're super close now, look at this. Ooh. I think you got it. Taste those coconuts already. Uh, can't wait. Okay, so yeah, com completely backwards. There's a lip if you put your foot down. Yeah. Yeah. And then there's another one. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, hopefully. Oh. 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 We're so close. <laughs> We're nearly there. You literally work your whole body doing this. It's pretty intense. We made it. We're basically here. Oh. so good conquering the challenge it right? It's good. It's good getting here. It's a beautiful beach. There's more people here than we thought there would be. Yes. So one thing we mentioned earlier is that that walk is going to be taken away. The Indonesian government are going to build an escalator to take away the challenge of coming down. I think it's going to support mass tourism on the beach which yeah. the charm and the beauty of being here is the challenging trek down. They're not doing it so that people who can't do that walk can come and enjoy it's, it. That's not what it's happening for. Tourism. It's happening for money. It's happening for tourism. One of the biggest problems with that, this beach is, is one of the most dangerous beaches in it's, Bali. The currents here are insane. People go out for a swim and they don't come back. Which is horrible. It really does happen. With yeah. more and more people coming down to this beach, there's gonna be way more cases of that happening. Yeah. But that's enough on that. There's nothing we can do to stop that. No. Nope. We can enjoy this beach right now. Because it is so beautiful. <laughs> so I think we need to go for a very sh small, shallow, safe swim. Maybe a little paddle. Yeah. That's enough. The current is crazy strong. Just, you can feel it just on your feet here. Oh my God! <laughs> oh, the waves are absolutely mental. 
look! After a long walk down. Oh, this way. <laughs> Don't try this at home, guys. Oh, I'm trying to get back out. I'm trying to get out again. Oh, it's so strong. Oh, oh. It nearly takes you under, like it's oh, really, really, really strong. Definitely don't do it if you're not a strong swimmer. And even if you are a strong swimmer, be really, really careful. We don't go any further than where we can't stand up. It's a pretty dangerous beach. <laughs> Got ourselves a coconut. Very needed after a nice swim. And obviously you're gonna have a little bit of inflation because the guys do bring it all the way down. So it was 90,000 rupiah for a coconut. Yeah. I Usually could... it's between 20 and 30. It's so nice though after It's really that. good. Regretting our decision to come down here. We had some really crazy traffic on that step bit down there, but now looks like we got there's a few people, but a clear run ish. A clear run. You're gonna go up. Off you go. Top tip for tackling Kellen King, definitely wear trainers. Do not do this in flip-flops. <laughs> Why did we do this to ourselves? <laughs> How good was that? Yeah. Good. <laughs> that breeze. One thing we've noticed, if you're gonna bring water, don't dump the bottles everywhere. Bring up your trash. Bring up your trash, people. Oh. It really is one of those things where you get the reward at the bottom. We think it's worth it. It is really, really tough, but so worth it. We made it to the steps. Hey. You doing okay? We're nearly there. We got there. You hanging in there? We're on the home straight. <sighs> the views from up here are amazing. It's even places like this. We made it. We made it. Oh, this coconut has never tasted so good. If ever there was a day for two coconuts, it was today. It's a two coconut kind of day. <laughs> now we've had our coconuts, we're a bit rejuvenated. Yes, we're going to give you our top five tips of visiting Kalinking and going down to the beach. Number one. I've already given you number one, which is to definitely wear the right footwear. Yes. Number two, make sure you bring plenty of water. This is so, so important. And number three. Just the same as with the water, you know, obviously the heat is pretty intense. Bring lots of sunscreen too. And number four, make sure you take your time on the way up and down. Otherwise you're gonna end up like me, 
with a little grazed knee <laughs> or worse so you don't want anything bad to happen and number five is the time of day that you go yeah. we would suggest going as early as possible to make that trek down and avoid this heat absolutely 100 join us next week and we're going to show you exactly why everyone is so obsessed with nusa panida there's a good reason for it see you next week Thank you.